Hey guys, welcome to Devotion, the new game by Red Candle. That's their name. Red Candle is the company's name. They did um, the Tension, which was 2D back in the day. That was cool to play through. Um, and now they're doing something completely different. I'm guessing the company kind of had the money they needed from the Tension to invest in something bigger. Um, but it seems to be like a haunted apartment mansion. A haunted apartment building in the 1980s, if I remember correctly, and um, it's haunted. Done. <laughs> what more do we need? Cat hairs everywhere. Let me look it up. If it doesn't crash. There you go. It reminds me of... Uh, oh. Okay. It's loading in. It reminds me of Pamali, honestly. Red Candle. 1980s, yep. Taiwan Apartment Complex. Is that one massive fish in the tank there? Also giving me home sweet home vibes. That was happening to me. My vision! It's going! Something happening? Something coming? What? Set on the TV. Oof. Also, wow, I have no color in my face. I need to adjust the white balance. So, was that a memory or. Hmm. One sec. It's already pretty high. Guess I'm just pale today. <laughs> okay. Okay, just click on it to activate it. Drawing done by Meishin. And how do I get to the next one, number two? Okay. I need a flashlight. That looks cool. Want to check out the fish? I want to check out the fish. The red arowana, a pet fish considered to bring luck and prosperity. TV just went back on. Okay, this is too dark to even see anything, so I guess we just need to follow the light. Is someone sitting there? TV, stay off. That looks like someone sitting in a chair. It's probably something else, but... Yeah, it's totally something else. God, it looks good. Did a good job. It's a rabbit! Oh, Year of the Rabbit, 1987. The year before I was born. I was born in the Year of the Dragon. Oh, that's cute! High chart that came with the powdered milk we bought. Records Macian's growth. Aww. Oh. Wait. Uh, excuse me? 
this is the same room. Very good so far. Hello? Well, it opens. Holy shit. That's cool. Damn. Who's holding the umbrella, though? Am I gonna grab it? It's a red shoe. Oh no. Should we- oh, I can't go any- Oh, Jesus, fuck! Holy shit, heart attack. Fuck. That went all the way through my arms. <laughs> so... I wonder if our Mation grew up to be an adult or something. We were d disappointed in her and then something happened. Hmm, house key. Is that our name? No. This is Box. That's to believe, but... I mean, maybe it is their name. You're the monkey! Oh! Wait, we skipped a couple of years. T for inventory. E to use. Oh, this is definitely different. You can't see because it's behind me, but it saves uh, every room, so... That's nice. It auto-saves a lot. Li Fang in her glory days. It's taking everything. Moving in. Scene one, living hall, daytime, interior. The husband carried a potty, potted plant over the window and places it on the sill. People say that tulips symbolize elegance and sweetness, just like our child. Like you know, our child hasn't even been born yet. All right, let's finish organizing and get dinner ready. The flower isn't blooming anytime soon, so let's eat. Soup's getting cold. Close up. The couple arrange their new home together. They hang her painting on the empty wall, set his medals on the cabinet, place their china on the shelves. Okay. So painting on the wall, medals on the cabinet, and china on the shelves. With a human touch, the empty abode begins to feel more like home. After adjusting the furniture, the husband returns to the living hall and finds his wife waiting for him with a gift. Okay, cabinet. Display cabinet. Um, so, trophy for display cabinet. Nice. I really like this so far. I mean, I knew I would like it. I, lo I loved attention. Lulu, creepy app, alpha flamer. Cre creepy, creamy. <laughs> Jesus. I'm so tired for some reason. Oh, right. I'm off my sugar. I'm trying to eat less sugar again. But as soon as I do, I, f I remember how reliant I am on sugar before recordings. Uh, painting. Oh, nice. Um, and then we need china on the shelves. Oh no, the room's open. Was this already open? This is Meishin's room. Hey, what are you doing? Big Boss is doing something. Okay. China, China, China. Must be in the kitchen, right? I don't 
don't know what Big Boss is doing. <laughs> yeah. Oh, hi. I got a fridge. It's a Tatong. It's a very good brand. <laughs> Tatong, so that's Big East. Yeah. Huh. Interesting. Okay. I was just sitting back to relax, game. What's that? A little ballerina. Ooh. Wait, wasn't there like a box for that in the room? Let's see if I can get there. I am super slow, so probably not where I'm supposed to go. But I'm gonna check anyway. Or oh, was this Mason's room? I thought this was the thing. Oh, is it a record player? Okay, never mind. <laughs> Let's limp all the way back. What do I do with it? Oh my god. Should I try to turn off the radio? Oh god. What is it? A lighter? We got that as a gift? Nice. Finally have some lighting. My dear Fung Yu, this is the lighter you've always wanted. You must be exhausted from all the unpacking. Get some rest. I want you to know that I'll always support you. Happy Father's Day, your loving wife. Aww. Cute. Excuse me? I wonder if there's collectibles or anything in this game. Maybe I've just been playing too much Resi. I keep thinking I need to find something or destroy something to collect. What year are we now? 86. That's way into the future. What do I do with the ballerina? <gasps> Who are you guys? The fuck? That's creepy. Cigarettes. This indispensable item for every writer. Uh, is that so? Maybe in the 80s, yeah. Monday. Did I miss that many files? Fuck, already? Jesus. Chinese vocabulary uh, practice. Today I cleaned my room and daddy helped me put all my toys away. My room has a b very big bed. I can play house on top of it. Okay. You checking out the fish? No, there's no fish yet. Oh Jesus, you scared me. <sighs> Why did it have to be dolls? Dude, you weren't dead. Oh god! Don't fucking move like that! Jesus. Fucking scary. Kids' room? Small chair, use some playing house. Oh, it's a. What's it called again? Metronome? 
Is that the word for it? Wait, did I forget? I used to have one actually, playing piano and stuff. Oh god. I'll take your doll, I guess. Please don't hate me. Do you want something else? Ooh, I got a camera! Nice! Can I take pictures? Oh, I can't get it. Fuck. I want to take pictures. Ah, oh, that reminds me. Visage needs to come back. That would be awesome. Everyone's looking at me. Fuck me. Is that the family? Why is the dad not in the frame? Why are you holding a knife? Fuck. I like you the least. Don't you dare. Should I just leave? Oh, I probably will put the thing on the chair. There we go. The birthday grab is a ceremony performed for a baby who's reached one year of age. In ancient times, the chances of a baby dying young were high. It was rare to reach the age of one, and so a cause for celebration. Therefore, in present times, to honor the ancestors and anticipate a safe and healthy future for the baby, this ceremony has become an important custom. People believe that placing various items in front of the baby and seeing what it grabs can predict, oh yeah, what type of career the baby will have in the future. I think they do that too in Japan. Commonly used items include a pen, ink, paper, enamel, abacus, garden tools, seals, etc. Other items include homophobic objects that correspond to careers or traits. What the fuck? Oh, homophonic. <laughs> Excuse me. Garlic sounds like Garlic? Sounds like calculate in Chinese. Oh, garlic sounds like calculate in Chinese and can pre represent an accounting career. It's a good translation, honestly. Onion sounds like smart and can represent an intellectual career. The direction of the child's development is of a great significant to, si significance to parents, especially in modern times. Parents expect a lot from a child's early education and it is wise to cultivate a child's interests and ex expertise from a young age to develop a head start in his or her career. Okay. Crayons. Besides singing, Meishin also loves doodling. Piano. Well, I got that figured out. Oh, Jesus, fuck. Oh, God, I hate these. Oh, it opens. Oh, it's a bathroom. They keep getting me. Oh, that's an intense bathtub. What's this? <gasps> it's a piano songbook. Okay. Don't look at me. God, this is so good. They're so creepy. <laughs> oh, they're gone. Boom, 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 boom. I am really liking this so far. Good scares. Nice and creepy. Don't break her. Oof. That's what I- What did I just say? Don't break her! <sighs> Hi, kid. Oh my god. It must be an actual show, isn't it? Oh, <laughs> At the top of the TV! Shout! <laughs> I 
<laughs> oh, what was it showing? Lighter time. Hello? 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 It reminds me of Layers of Fear as well, actually. I like it. I mean, you guys know I fucking love the Asian shit. Asian horror is the best. Hence why my channel is has so much Asian horror stuff. <laughs> fucking hell, dudes. So rude, you don't throw balls inside. So today they celebrate their child's birthday as candles light the cozy room. The joy of family and peaceful celebration. My sweet child, what gift would you prefer? Father will grant you anything. I am grateful father, mother, but I do not wish for a gift. I just want our family to be mirthful and content. For the child, such an ordinary moment would be especially cherished. If you'd like to know why, we must talk about that strange illness. Hmm. <laughs> Drawings. Looks great. That reminds me, the new chapter for Home Sweet Home should come out somewhere in the next couple months. I think. 1985. Okay. Oh, it's a surgical mask. <clears throat> Third year student, Du Xin Mei. Difficulty breathing, sent to school clinic. Emergency transportation to a hospital. Further medical testing is advised as early as possible. After receiving this notice, notice and seeking further medical attention, have the doctor fill out the reply form with the treatment provided. Return the reply slip to the school medical clinic so, we, so that we may continue to provide the student with medical care. Asthma? So, my child got had some kind of disease. They turned the fridge! It's still a tatong though. Hey, quiet. Hey, quiet, you're right in front of the screen. I can't see. Wash hands before entering. Hmm. That's wash. That's hand. So maybe... Oh, this is must. Must wash hands. I can barely read it. So this is a proceed into the room. I, I had like six months of Chinese. So I know like a couple things. Oh, maybe we should just use the bathroom. Um, but I totally forgot how to pronounce it. So like I can't, I can read a lot of Chinese, but I use my Japanese for it, if that makes sense. So like I, I recognize all the characters and I know just enough grammar to get by in Chinese, but I couldn't for the life of me pronounce it in Chinese. Oh, dude, you're only making it worse. Uh. Don't faint. Okay, you good. Clean hands. You're a clean bean. Don't worry. I kind of want a bath stop like that now. <laughs> Can I get like a super bright one like that? I wonder if there's like, if it's super linear. And that's it's like really hard to miss anything, or if I'm just already missing files and stuff. Just because I'm not checking everywhere. Oh, it's turning into a hospital bed. 
Oh god, what do you need? Oof. Jesus. Poor girl. Oh. Oh, she's good again. Do machine. Female, 10 years old, thorac thoracic specialist. Chest tightness, difficulty breathing. No physical ailments observed. Recommend. Oh, damn it. They can't find what it is. Cut x ray film. Hmm. Might have to make a, do a puzzle somewhere. I would like a puzzle. Yes, please. Huh. Remember Shirio <laughs> no Yashiki? <laughs> Let's not take any talismans down. Oh, we're in the hospital now? Fuck. Lots of toilet paper. Child's room, night interior. Candles illuminate the bed and the herbal tea remedy. Father, when will we go down to the big city? Into the big city. We cannot do so under these troubling circumstances. Son, when your illness has passed, mother and I will take you anywhere you like. Father, the needles are painful. This treatment is unbearable. The husband pulls the acu acupunctural needles out of his child. No more pain. No more pain. Father will have, won't have you suffer any longer. The child, tired from crying, drifts into sleep. How is this going to work? It's been such a long time. My heart aches. Set your mind at ease. I've, I, have a, I have another way. <sighs> I don't know if acupuncture would be a viable treatment for anything. I mean, I'm sure it can do something, but it sounds like she has like a really bad illness, so... Switch pieces... And move? Oh... Um... Do these two go together? I mean, that's a shoulder. This maybe goes below here? Looks like that would match. Maybe I can add my things? And that's the center. Oof. Oh god, what? What am I doing? Can I... Okay, I can't move. I can only look around, so... I can only change direction. What do I need it for? Oh, behind us? Maybe we can put it on the girl. Ooh, the talisman. Oh, Jesus. Phone call. Hello? Gap speaking. Upstairs? Can I? Here I go! Rocket! Hmm, room? The fuck's that? Someone sitting by the chair, listening to the radio. It's had to come upstairs, right? Is she just hanging out in the corner? That's not creepy at all.
Mm, just trying not to hear anything. Oh, this looks cool. Damn. I really like this. It's so good so far! What a joy to play through. Oh! We're sitting down in the starting screen of the game. Starting scene, I guess I should say. Sort of. Hmm. She was on a singing show? Did they fucking record this for this game? I thought it was just using some kind of copyrighted show, but... Sing. Fuck it. I want to hear her sing. Sing, little girl. Sing. Where do I walk to? Oh. Oh, the painting is far away. Why the hell would you have a painting in your room, though, where the fucking dad's face is not on it? Oh. Oh, there's a statue behind it. Oh, that's fucking awesome. What? What? Oh my god! That was so good! Oh, I'm drowning. Oh, so good. Oh! Another painting up there. Oh god! What was that? Fuck. Okay. Achievement unlocked. Dip into your memories. There she goes. Should we follow her? I feel like that was a chapter then though, if I got an achievement for it. I feel like I kinda mm, wanna cut it here, but should I make longer episodes? I don't know. I have no idea how long this game is. I was thinking I would do like hour long episodes. Uh, articles, 1980. Hmm. We're gonna collect articles. Why is there a blo bloody bathtub in the center? Oh, 1985? Oh, so we're gonna do these sections. 1986? And then this is the one we're gonna do now? Maybe. So we have three upcoming sections. Let's check this out then. See what happens. Collect the fragments of the past, traverse into a flawless present. Huh. Okay, so to get to our kid, we have to collect all these things. Oh, wow. So now we can do them. So there's 1980. 1985 and 1986. Should we just start with 1980 then? Oh, that's really cool. Someone's having a party in there. Okay, in that case, I will cut it into this. It, it, cut it. Jesus, my English today is such a fucking mess. I will cut the episode here. Um, and then hopefully I can do one episode for 1980, one episode for 1985, one episode for 1986, and finish it. So, like, three more episodes? 
I hope you guys agree with that plan. I think that's a good idea. Um, but yeah, let's cut it here in that case, and I hope you guys liked it. I'm excited to see more. Thank you so much for watching till the end, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye!